In today's video, I'm going to show you what I think is the very best 343 tactic that you can download for Football Manager 2023. This is the Spielmaker by Vujovic FM23 V7, and this is what I think is the best 343 that you can download for Football Manager 2023. Let's start off by breaking down some of the positions that you're going to need when you download this tactic too. Starting at the back, we've got a sweeper keeper who is set to support. On the left side of your three-man defence, we've got a ball-playing defender set to defend. In the middle, you have a libero set to support. On the right, you've got a ball-playing defender set to defend. On the left-hand side, a complete wing-back set to attack. Two Segundo Volantes in the middle set to support. And on the right-hand side, a complete wing-back set to attack. You then have a Shadow Striker set to attack. And two Advanced Forwards set to attack. So as I said, it's the Spielmaker by Vujovic FM23 V7. Its tactical style is custom amateur style. Its mentality is attacking. We show you the in possession, it will look like this. The in transition will look like this. And the out of possession will look like this. So I've been putting this tactic through its paces. I'm going to show you four sims that I have done just to show you how good this tactic can be and prove why I think it's the best 343 that you can download in FM23. To kick off the results, we are in England down in Skybet League 1. We're looking for Bolton Wanderers and we find them top of the league. Break down their league campaign. They've played 46 games. They've won 36. They drew six, they lost four, scored 107, conceded 43, had a goal difference of 64, and they finished on 114 points. That put them eight points clear of their nearest rivals, which was Ipswich. If we go to the profile page, we can see Adeboyejo got 31 goals. He had a 7.37 average rating. Williams got 13 assists, as did Morley. Adeboyejo got nine Player of the Match awards. Johnston got 16 yellow cards. Sheehan got 15.74 kilometres covered per 90 minutes. And Lee got 15.63. Look at the other competitions that they played in. We can see that they played in the FA Cup. They got through to the fourth round where they were knocked out by Norwich City. In the Carabao Cup, they were knocked out in the first round by Shrewsbury Town. And in the Papa John's Trophy, they got knocked out in the quarterfinals by Chelsea's under-21s. Up next, we moved across to Italy. We're looking at Serie B, and we find Venezia top of the league. If we break down their league campaign, they have played 38, won 27, drew 4, lost 7, scored 79, conceded 42, had a 37 goal difference, and they finished on 85 points, leaving them 10 points clear of their nearest rivals, Frosinone. If we go to the profile page of the league, we have Redham getting 18 goals. He had a 7.21 average rating. Candela got 12 assists. We had Capitelli with 16 yellow cards and Carboni with 14. Zampano got 15.9 distance covered per 90 minutes. And Baghetto got 15.17. If we go to the other competitions they played in, that was just the Italian Cup where they were knocked out in the third round by Napoli. Up next, we are in Austria, looking at the Austrian Premier Division, and we are looking for Rapid. We find them top of the Austrian Premier Division. Let's break down their league campaign. They played 22 games. They won 20, drew 1, lost 1, scored 52, conceded 13, had a goal difference of 39, and 61 points. Now, at that point, they were 15 points clear of the rest. But obviously, in Austria, it splits into a championship and relegation group. When we go into that, we still find them top. They have played 32 now, won 27, drawn 3, lost 2, scored 73, conceded 22, had a goal difference of 51, and they finished on 53 points, winning the league by 8 points from Red Bull Salzburg. Going to the profile page... We can see that Grohl got 20 goals, Bergstaller got 19, Grohl got 7.53 average rating, Cassius 7.45 and Bergstaller 7.43. 
Cassius got 10 assists. Grawl 8 Man of the Match awards with Cassius on 5. Heddle got 14 clean sheets. And Koshinek got 14.98 kilometres covered per 90 minutes. We go to the competitions tab for the other things they played in. They played in the Europa Conference League where they were knocked out in the PATH qualifying round by Brondby. And in the Austrian FA Cup they were knocked out in the quarterfinals by Austria Vienna. Finally, to wrap up the results, we have come to the Premier League. We're looking for Arsenal and we find them top of the league, winning the Premier League. Break down their league campaign. They have played 38, won 33, drew 3, lost 2, scored a league high 117 goals. They conceded 31, giving them a goal difference of 86 and they won the league with 102 points. That means that they finished eight points clear of Liverpool in second place. If we go to the profile page, we can see that Martinelli got 22 goals. Jesus got 22 goals. Odegaard a 7.67 average rating. Jesus 7.56. Martinelli 7.43. Odegaard got 13 assists, as did Tommy Asu. We had Odegaard with nine player of the match awards. Ramsdale kept 16 clean sheets. Alneni covered 15.52 kilometres per 90 minutes and Tierney 15.09. Look at the other competitions that they played in. They played in the Europa League where they also won that competition, beating Manchester United in the final 3-1. They reached the semi-finals of the FA Cup where they were knocked out by Liverpool and they reached the quarter-finals of the Carabao Cup where they were knocked out by West Ham United. So that is the reason that I think this is the very best 343 that you can download for Football Manager 2023. You've seen it win top leagues. You've seen it win littler leagues. You've also seen it win European competitions. I really do think this is a tactic you can download, plug and play, and you're going to have a lot of success with. Right, if you're still with me at this point of the video, firstly, a big thank you. Secondly, if you don't mind hitting the like and subscribe button to help the channel out, I really would appreciate it. Watching the growth of the channel across the past couple of months has been fantastic. It's all down to people like yourself who are watching the video and interacting. Before you go, don't forget there's other things on the channel. We have other tactic testers, there's let's play, hints, tips and tutorials. But for this one, I'm going to leave it there. A big thank you for watching. I'll see you on another video soon.